guys welcome to the channel so the robert tusi decided to violate ddg and his girlfriend ruby rose last night on instagram live and now all of this started because ddg allegedly slid in tusi's girlfriend's dm now y'all when i say tusi violated and went off on ddg and ruby rose that's exactly what he did he started talking about ruby rose being ran through in the industry he started talking about ddg not wearing the pants in his relationship with ruby rose i'm about to go ahead and play the live for you guys and then i'm going to come back with ddg tweets about the live and to see and what ruby rose had to say as well I. Let me, let me say what I was about to say. Okay, let me just get out of the camera because I just keep laughing. You can see my cheekbones through my phone. Listen, all right, look, right? This is what I was about to say. This is my lovely girlfriend, right? One of you fing, um. One of you fing, yeah. I right, don't look now. Now I don't. I don't, 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 don't want to be in the camera. Nah, go ahead. This is my lovely girlfriend, right? Um. One of y'all, one of you little fing YouTuber uh, rappers. Feel me? Wanna be funny and and all that. I ain't gotta state no names, no none of that. Listen, all I'ma say, right? Just cause your fucking girlfriend a smut, nah. No. No, no. <laughs> all right. No. All right. Anyways, though, stop all that funny shit, man. Cause I don't like niggas. And I don't care for niggas. You know? Especially not no fucking suburban. You heard? Especially not no fucking suburban. Y'all y'all stop trying to be funny though. Get off the internet, you know. Stay out of DM, so let's not be funny. You feel me? And that's that. Keep it at that. <laughs> oh, you lucky. You lucky. You lucky. Mm, you lucky. Nah, I ain't lucky. I ain't lucky shit. Mm. He lucky. Okay. Long story short, y'all. <clears throat> I don't play about it. No, 50s are good luck. No, 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 here. How much is it? <laughs> hey guys. Is it you ain't saying nothing, huh? No. Why is this, you be a hot boy? Is this soy sauce in there? She's not even awkward, y'all. I don't know why she's being awkward. Why y'all laughing? You must have said something. I didn't say anything. Yes, you did. <laughs> he left to go breathe. Breathe, bro. Go ahead, y'all. It's not going to stay up there. Get on, man. Long story short, like. Cause y'all should be being goofy. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> I got 
need this light on? Yeah. It's illegal to drive with lights on. Nah, I know that shit is not. That's what your parents told you growing up, huh? <laughs> I'm talking about it. I ain't never said that's who it was. I don't mean to tell someone. I ain't never said his name. And the nigga not like, it ain't, you know, ain't doing all of that. The message you get to who it need to get to. You feel me? Like, just don't try to be funny and all that. All the internet shit and all that. Nigga don't. I, done, I seen niggas make so many tweets about a nigga. Nigga ain't never say nothing on none of that. Nigga, a nigga DM me about this bitch. Yeah, hey, bro, what's up with such and such? Like, you know, just tell me if y'all really be talking. <laughs> and then come back, like, double back on some more shit. Some more shit, you know? Like, what? Yeah, though. Next topic. Yeah, next topic. I love y'all. Feel me? I'm about to go eat some food. Um, general message. If your bitch done been fucked by... Okay, 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 okay. No, okay. don't do that. Okay. Don't do that. Okay. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. We're not doing 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 that. No, don't do that. We're not. Okay. Let me, let me. Back to what I was saying on my phone, y'all. Yeah, jeez, I'm like... I'm like if your bitch done been fucked by every rap nigga in the fucking game, you heard? Go chastise your bitch before you 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 come talk to another nigga. You heard? Long story short, put it like that. And whoever take the message the way they take it, they take it like that. It is what it is. If you ain't even a man in your fucking relationship, if you don't if you don't wear the pants in your fucking relationship. Don't step outside your relationship to come say nothing to nobody else, you heard? Now, I love y'all. My girlfriend telling me to get off live. My girlfriend telling me to get off live. Fuck. So you guys heard what Tusi had to say in that live. You guys let me know down in the comment section, how did you feel about all the things that he said in the live? One thing I don't like is every time somebody get into it with DDG or Ruby Rose get into it with somebody, they always want to bring up her sexual activity, I will say, that she had going on. Why does that matter? What does that have to do with DDG allegedly sliding in your girl's DM? Nothing. Anyways, DDG tweeted and said, if we beef, we beefing for life. He also said, big bank take a little bank. He said, can't beef with a ninja who broker than me. I don't gain nothing from it. DDG also said, it's always different energy in a person than online. And that's true with a lot of people. I'm pretty sure everybody that's watching this video then experienced something like this. 
Aubrey Rose responded to this situation as well and said, ninjas get so mean when you curve them. Now, I'm pretty sure you're like, what does she mean? So, DDG actually responded in the Shade Room team's comments, and here's what he said. DDG said, ninja got H'd by Ruby and got mad. Be faithful to your girl, little bruh. So, basically, what DDG is saying is that Tusi tried to slide in Ruby Rose DM, I'm guessing, and Ruby Rose curved him, didn't want to talk to him. So, he ended up getting mad, and I guess this when this whole situation happened, DDG even proved that he did not slide into Tusi's girlfriend's DM. DDG posted this screenshot on his Instagram story, and basically, it's a message request from Tusi's girlfriend. DDG said, I ain't DM her, she DM me, dog." So DDG, I don't know what to say about this whole situation. It's just too messy and too much going on. I just feel like if it was this much drama and everything, they should have just handled this offline, to be honest. So that's it for the video, guys. Let me know what you think about this down in the comment section below. Do you guys feel like DDG did slide in Tusi's girlfriend DM? Or do you guys feel like Tusi's girlfriend slid in DDG's DM? Let me know your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, and also hit the notification bell. And as always, thanks for watching.